don't realize it yet, but your life is about to cease to exist. What are you talking about? I am going to kill one of your ancestors, effectively erasing you from history. Here, play with this. At least you can spend your final moments doing something you enjoy. You know, it's funny. I had actually stopped playing with that toy, but now that I see you with it, I kind of want to play with it again. <laughs> Look at me. I'm mowing the lawn. <laughs> all that noise. Brian, it was Bertram. He's gone into the past, and he claims he's going to... Ah! Stewie, what's going on? Peter, what was that? Quick, Brian, into the time machine. in time, Brian, emanating from some point in the past. But there's only one explanation. Bertrand told me he planned to kill one of my ancestors. He must have succeeded, thereby changing the past and erasing me. But what has that got to do with... I created the universe, Brian. Bertram didn't know that by removing me from history, I wouldn't be there to be accidentally thrown outside the universe and subsequently created. So the universe never existed. Well, we have to stop him. Yes. Unfortunately, Bertram took the return pad with him. So we'll only get one shot at this. Ah, here it is. Now we'll have to travel back in time to a point shortly before Bertram's arrival. Get ready, Brian. How long until Bertram arrives? I can't be certain, but I'd say about 15 minutes. Where do you think we are? I don't know. Looks like the Renaissance. Does. This doesn't count as our trip to Italy. Brian, look, there's the Mona Lisa. And it's unfinished. We must be in Leonardo da Vinci's studio. Quick, someone's coming. <gasps> that must be Leonardo da Vinci. Stewie, he looks just like you. Da Vinci must be my ancestor. Good Lord. That's who Bertram's here to kill. So that means you're Italian. Of course, my love for SpaghettiOs and smoking on the toilet. It all makes sense. Ew.